Hey guys, this is Fiend Frenzy 91 and I'm talking about Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Remember how we were talking about Call of Duty Modern Warfare size before, I believe? Well, there's a new update, and what's weird is that on the PS4 and PC, this update is 2 gigabytes, right? On the Xbox One, the update is 66 gigabytes. Apparently, the reason why it is so large is an issue with the patch delivery system on the platform, but that's a huge difference. It's not like even it's 10 gigabytes and it's 2. It's 66 and it's 2. Truth be told, that's not all I want to talk about. Are we really entering into the age? We're not exactly there yet, but I feel like next systems, you know, Xbox Series X and PS5. But here's the thing. PS5 doesn't even have a terabyte of hard drive space, and the Xbox Series X only has a terabyte. So how will you do this? So if this becomes like the next model of gaming, by that I mean, you know how ever since like Xbox 360 era, when multiplayer games kind of realized that they could add DLC, even single player ones too, but multiplayer DLCs I find... They add a lot more and expansion packs and whatnot than single player does, I find, in general. Such as like, will the Halo Infinite, will it start off like, let's just say being like 80 gigabytes, and then by the time they're done with it, it'll be like, what, 300 gigabytes? That's what I'm talking about. Will Halo on all these other type of games that are multiplayer focused, more so than single player focused, will they start to really crowd our hard drives? With Xbox Series X even, I don't think you can even buy a regular external hard drive for it. I think you have to, the Xbox Series X games, actually buy those special Seagate hard drives, which are kind of expensive. So this is just one of those things, like with games not only being bigger sizes, but in some cases ending a much larger size than when you first bought them, like Call of Duty Modern Warfare on the Xbox One right now is almost 200 gigabytes, so like 180 something. I mean, I mean, if you wanna enjoy a good amount of games on your systems, you already have to buy uh, external hard drive in most cases either that or you can do the whole delete a lot of games and then reinstall later or something like that but that's just annoying so i'm just wondering so, so does anybody else think like me though that the next series of consoles from microsoft and sony will really completely be killing your hard drives because i feel like with games getting bigger they're already getting bigger we know that with the next set because they're going to be 4k so i just feel like the next series like the xbox series x and ps5 like, you're going to need those externals. You're going to need probably to buy those Seagate hard drives, those special ones for the Xbox Series X especially. Because we already know with 4K gaming, the games are going to be a lot bigger in general. And it seems like games not only in, in this new style are a lot bigger, but they end up a lot bigger than they started in certain cases, like with Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Anyway, what do you guys think about the difference between Call of Duty update sizes on the Xbox One and the PS4 being 66 gigabytes to 2? And also, do you think that this is the future for a lot of multiplayer games where they're going to end up being a lot larger in size than they began? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. May God bless you all.